stop getting tangled in my hair. Hi guys and dolls! So today I'm doing a little bit of a different video. It's nice and sunny here in Ireland and I know that there's lots of festivals and things like that coming up. We're in spring now, we're coming up to summer and a lot of people are asking me about skin on their bodies. So how to make the skin on your body soft and sexy and sun kiss. You watch my channel, you'll know that I'm Irish, you'll know that I'm usually as pale as a snowman's bum and I like to change up my look because well obviously I'm into makeup but I kind of consider getting a bit of a tan and things like that the exact same as dyeing my hair, changing my clothes so I don't want any comments saying that I'm shaming paleness and stuff. It's not like that at all. I just want to share some tips with you guys that have made my skin feel really really soft and look nice and tan and it makes me kind of feel like I have that healthy glow for this time of year. I love it so much. I'm going to cover three easy steps and these are things that I think a lot of us think that we do regularly that we actually don't in terms of looking after our bodies. I myself have suffered with keratosis pilaris on the backs of my arms and on my legs which is a genetic kind of skin disorder type thing where it's real rough and bumpy and also certain times a year I tend to get really dehydrated skin and it just gets really dry like dry ass and by the way I'm not naked I'm wearing a bathing suit because it's really nice out and we're going down to the beach today for a little while so yeah let's just clear that up not naked right so I launch into these three little steps step one is to make a DIY body scrub and I always talk about different scrubs and that that I like but I found that the homemade ones are just as good and they're a lot cheaper so you can save money you can pick yourself up little jars like this in supermarkets Tesco anywhere like that for really cheap and I've loads of these lying around I kind of decorate it with some little diamantes because that's just what I like to do but yeah for a homemade DIY scrub you'll need some kind of granules to make up the scrubby part of the base and my favorite different types of ones are sugar sea salt or even coffee and all three of these have different benefits for your skin you can totally mix and match them or just go with one it makes me feel a little bit like I'm in Hogwarts playing around my potions I always wanted to marry Snape what can I say I don't care his voice is just sexy okay you'll need an oil base as well so my two favorites are extra virgin olive oil and coconut oil and I know that sometimes coconut oil can be a bit difficult to melt and it's a bit more expensive so today I'm just gonna go with olive oil and things that you can add in that you don't need to are things like honey to make it a little bit more moisturizing and a little bit sweeter not that you're gonna eat it but you technically could you can also add scented oils like lavender oil to give it a nice scent and even a little bit of food coloring and some heavy oil stops the food coloring from coloring your skin so you can totally add a little dash of that if you want to color it up the one I made today to show you guys is uh, green because I'm Irish and might as well so you can scrub off all the dead skin on your body because your body sheds skin cells very very regularly and you need to scrub them off if you want your skin to be smooth and ready for the next step which is cleansing the skin and moisturizing it so I am extremely excited to be working with Dove on this video um, I've mentioned their old body wash in my videos and their hair mask loads of videos that I've featured Dove in um, they've been one of my favorite brands ever since I've seen all their different campaigns about you know body acceptance and they just run amazing campaigns for women and stuff but yeah anyway on to the body wash this is their new body wash so they've reformulated the old one and um, this is the original scent so it smells the same don't fear if you're also a big fan of Dove it makes me so nostalgic my Nana always used to have Dove soap and she used to tell me all the time to use it Um, I love it so much so yeah, the new breakthrough formula. Basically, these are the ones in the shop that say Nutrium Moisture. And I know we got a couple of them on half price because they also have like an exfoliating one and they've got different scents but this gives you softer, smoother skin after one shower. It says that on the bottle, and I know a lot of products don't do what they say on the tin. This really does. I was full on shocked when I noticed how much this lathers, and lathering in the shower just makes it feel so much more pampering and stuff. I love bubbles, I love suds, I love being covered head to toe in them, and this does it like that. I love putting it into one of those kind of sponges and just running all over my body. And I also love these kind of little body exfoliators 
exfoliating mitts for running it along my skin. Yeah, I've been using this for about two weeks now and even after the first time I used it I noticed my skin was softer than normal because uh, before I had this one I was using some weird one that my dad gave me um, and yeah just so so good. It's milder than the old one so they've changed up the ingredients to replace some of the harsher chemicals that can be found in other brands on the market and stuff so it's better for your skin now and really pampering just all around improved the body wash and yeah I'm loving this I've got as I said I've got a few in there so they're gonna last me for months and in case any of you are asking me what body wash I'm using Dove that original scent is so good so the next step is adding some gradual tan to your body. If you're pale like me and you don't want to use a full-on self-tanner, um, you can add a bit of your tan into your moisturizer, your regular body moisturizer, if you want, and that'll kind of give more gradual, subtle, natural results. The one I want to feature and share with you is something I have shared in a couple of videos before, but sure, when it's not broke, don't fix it, right? The Dove Summer Glow Nourishing Lotion, and this has a subtle, gradual self-tanner in it. I know. A lot of people rave about this but guys seriously if you're fair to medium skin like me they have um, two different versions so they've got a fair one and one for darker skinned ladies or men men can also use this of course this doesn't leave streaks it is foolproof tanning and um, you basically just moisturize your entire body every day like once a day for a few days in a row and bam like I'm sorry but look how much browner I am than normal I just whip that off it's getting hot in here my viewers will know I don't even ever have a hint of color on me but um I really like the subtle color that this gives thankfully also it doesn't have that really gross fake tan smell that you get on a lot of fake tans the only thing I'd say with this is after you've applied it to your body wash your hands thoroughly to make sure you don't get those kind of little weird marks in your hands there so annoying that kind of like orangey tan build up so even though this contains like a tan to give you a subtle it's very like a nice sun-kissed glowy look um it's also a really good body moisturizer so it says that it has essential oil to help gradually improve skin starting deep down and hey guys the thing with looking after your body is you just need to do it consistently so make sure that each time you're washing your body you are using products that are going to put it into good condition so what a lot of people do is they'll get into like a scalding hot shower and you know run a little stuff under their arms and wherever else that they might want to kind of wash but they don't actually focus on their skin and you need to look after your body's skin as much as your face we have a skincare routine for our face so why not for our body do you know what I mean so yeah that's that's the final step in my little routine that I've been doing and it's really working for me my boyfriend has noticed a difference in how soft my body is you can totally add to this routine this is just a nice base to build on and I hope that you enjoyed this video if you have any kind of really soft skincare tips to share with us leave them in a comment below thank you so much for watching guys and um, I'm vlogging today there's a little bit of information for you <laughs> bye